What up dogs, Steve here, and today I have a Q&A video I asked on Twitter for some questions. I got a few, and if you have more, you can drop them in the comment section. Maybe I can do another episode. I might put gameplay in the background, or I might just do this again, because uh, I think this is going to be a pretty long video, even though I only took like 15 questions or something like that. I don't know exactly, uh, but let's get started. Um, let me see. All right, we have Jano Pox starting here with a question. He says, what is the best memory you have from COD days from now to CS? Which is a super, super hard and big question. I, um, a part of me is, thinks that like the best like gaming related memory I have is probably like coming into the Machinima office, which Machinima doesn't really uh, exist that much uh, anymore. But the Machinima office and like I met uh, CNNers uh, during the weekend when I come came to LA and then I remember like oh there's Hutch like Nanner said and and he just like came over to me and I was like it's weird because I've been watching them for so long and now they were like my pals and I was gonna be there and I was like hi always up Dave's like how are you man ah, that's fine like that's really cool so yeah that that's like something just like all the entire time in just LA was just like a blast. There's um there's some consolated questions and that's that's probably one of the reasons why I'm still living in, in uh once I didn't like live there longer is because I have Crohn's, which is kind of sucky but that's probably my best memory. Uh we got Excel Alex Stang who's uh asking when is the next episode of Ask Tapesy? You're late on the upload. I know man. If Ask Tapesy is going to be re rebooted, I actually have to build up my YouTube channel a little harder. I have to work really, really hard to get more views here. But there's a possibility. There's green screens available all over the place. So, uh, but I, I still have like a... I want to make it, but I still have to get like a little... I need to be better at what I'm doing on YouTube again. So, yeah. Uh, Anderson P20, a friend of mine, is actually asking, What is your biggest fear in having Crohn's? misspelled uh, and what is it like living with it now to compare it to before my biggest fear with Crohn's is obviously uh, either to get my stoma back or to get cancer because the risk of getting uh, abdominal cancer or not abdominal but like getting col col colon cancer is higher when you have Crohn's and that would fucking suck or just getting really bad and worse again so I had to uh, get my stoma back that would really fucking suck um, so I'm, I know I'm like, I'm trying my best to not like be bad, like get bad, um, with like eating and working out and stuff, but, uh, I, I still just want to live. So I, I try to like be in between and just make sure that I take my medication. I, uh, I sleep and then I try not to stress. So that's probably how I handle it. And before, when I was younger, uh, when having Crohn's, I was not really like paying attention to it. I was just kind of like doing whatever, like drinking like everyone else. And I, uh, I was kind of like neglecting my body. So now I feel like I'm taking care of myself more. I never really know if my body and is going to like work a nine to five job with having Crohn's. There are not that many people that are, are not like 100% all the time that can do that. So um, in the future, I just see myself um, still always making YouTube videos, but making like the best out of having Crohn's. So yeah, pretty deep question there. Grad source asking, do you even lift bro? Sometimes, yeah. I worked out a lot more before I met Victoria, but now I'm just going there like three times a week or something. So it's, I still lift a little bit. Um, Squirrel is asking, do you have any favorite video of your own? Um, I mean, I like, I like the to the face video, even though I can't watch it, but it's really fucking cool that it's, it's so like so many views on it. But I think I like some of my own montages on battlefield three is probably some of my favorite because I just think they're so clean. They're like, there were 60 FPS and everything was so smooth. And uh, yeah, I think I actually kind of like those uh, if I if I got to choose one of them. So you can search for Tablelicious. I'll fucking put him in the description. Uh, Timba is asking, how does, it get, how does it feel to get boosted? Fuck you, Timba. I beat you in 1v1. That's my Finnish friend. So uh, how did you get your first knife in CSGO? Jeppe Morris is asking that. Um, 
So I had my friend has told me to start uh, streaming CS:GO. So I had I got about oh shit, my camera is flashing. I got about like a hundred dollars from uh, Twitch. I put that it in on on my Steam, and I bought a ban bayonet vanilla for those money. Like the first month I ever had ever been streaming, I was like, fuck yeah, so pleased. I'll hopefully I can do this before my camera crashes. So. You two man's one is saying, what did your parents think, uh, thought about YouTube when you started making videos? Well, they were kind of like my mom, uh, I, I answered this question before, but my mom was like, well, you shouldn't spend so much time making videos and stuff. Cause I was both in school and I was working uh, part time at Swedbank, calling up customers to try to set like, uh, times for, for like counseling for their economics. So. They were like, my dad was just like, do whatever makes you happy, son. Man, I'm gonna be proud of you. <laughs> yeah, my, like, and then like, like the, when I, they noticed how happy it made me, they were just very supportive. Um, Nasher is asking, do you have a second name? And yes, what is it? I, my second name is actually my first name. So my name is Lars Tobias. Lars Tobias. Lars. So uh, it's like a family <laughs> name, sort of. So yeah. <laughs> Uh, Gaming Felix is asking, do you think working with Splay and trying to do Swedish YouTube have affected your standalone channel negatively? And if so, why? Not really negatively. Uh, maybe I put a little too much, like I, I kind of neglected making videos on my own channel at this time. It's like a Swedish YouTube network. I don't think it affected it negatively other than me not having time, like not putting down as much time, which I'm doing now. Don't worry. Don't worry, guys. Uh, what do you see? Uh, what do you want to see in the next COD? Kevin is asking that. I want to see World War II. Not fucking future, no bouncy thingy, just fucking gun skills with some nades, no stupid fucking kill streaks. Just don't make it complicated. Whoever is making the next call, dude. I don't know if it's Infinity Ward or if it's some other thing. So, uh, Face Cohen is asking, do you still have cookie of chicks in your apartment? I only have my girlfriend now. And we don't even have cookie. I just drink coffee. Okay, guys, this was actually all the questions that I had on Twitter that were kind of like sensible and normal. But I hope you guys enjoyed a little Q&A. If you guys have more questions, drop them in the comments. My battery is running out of my camera, so it was a pretty short Q&A. But it might be uh, some of the stuff that you guys are wondering. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to drop a like button. And I'll see you guys. Oh. What up folks, TV here, and today I'm gonna tell you guys a little story about how I started playing 